episode 89 nice of the adventure begins with jazz and i'm jarek and here are your events for this week wednesday virtual trivia with me you already know how to sign up we talk about it every week the reason why i keep bringing it up because we have winners here are your weekly winners Want to give it up to Jess. She was our Mezcal Cantina winner. Nice. And you know what? I totally forgot who won the comic book. But it was a punchline number one. So, lucky you. Proud of you. <laughs> Stacy right. Todd. What's up? Stacy Todd? Stacy Todd won it. Got it. Ha <laughs> There you go. Right on, man. That's why That's why he's my sidekick. My co-host, rather. There you go. He, he remembers I ain't, I ain't stuff. nobody's sidekick. <laughs> Wednesday, November 25th, we got local comic shop day. And this happens all day. It Use, is all day. It is all day. It's an all-day event, and these are special usually because they usually come out with like exclusives just for local comic shop day. Usually, where you can like use your points and all that jazz. Usually, well, now they're just coming out with everything. Usually, so just show up, and we're gonna have some stuff for you. It's pretty pretty usual. <laughs> Thursday, November twenty-sixth. Happy Thanksgiving! Gobble gobble, we're closed, so yeah. don't come knocking on the door. And guess what, man? This is an all-day event as well. It is an all-day <laughs> event, technically. Any fun plans for Thanksgiving? Man, just hanging out, getting fat. Nice. Like everybody else. Same. What's yours? I don't know. No? I don't know. Probably eating around. Let's be real. It's going to be a lot of food sitting around. Mm -hmm. gonna foosball. Watch, gonna, you know, have a lot of foosball. Um, parades? Sure. It's going to happen. Wake up with a parade? Can't go wrong. Yeah. It always starts way too early, though. Yeah, that's why I don't get up that early. That's why I don't get it, yeah. I get yeah. up right before it's time to eat that first round of food. There you go. What do you guys do for Thanksgiving, man? Let us know right there in the comments and all that jazz. It's really simple. Saturday, November 28th, in Digimon pre-sale tournament. Because it's Digidoo. 12.30. What's it all about, man? So, we're going to have our good friends over at Nerd Thug Radio. Radio, radio, radio. Truckosaurus Rex. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. It's a thing from last year. You're welcome. Yeah. It's that's what we call a callback. Anyway, our friends from Nerd Thug Radio are going to host this really cool pre-sale tournament mm -hmm. in which you're going to have, a, you know, you're going to get packs, you're going to make decks, you're going to combat one another in the Digimon world, and then we're hopefully giving prize support away, so it's going to be a really fun, awesome event. Starts at 12.30 that Saturday, November 28th. Is it, uh, how do you enter? Do you just come in and just, hey, I want, I want my pre-stuff? Should be online signups. Right on. It, does Should it cost be. money? It does. Does it cost Digibucks? There's going to be a couple Digibucks you got to throw at this thing to oh. make it work. Right no on. cryptocurrency allowed, though, unfortunately. No way. Bill bucks, possibly. Of course. Always, Always. bill bucks. Always bill bucks. That's right. Sunday, November 29th, we got the D&D uh, Junior Adventure League. That's right. Signups are once again online on the website. Go there. If you don't find them on there, odds are... Pay attention. We're full. It doesn't mean we have seats hidden away somewhere. Mm -hmm. It doesn't mean you got to call us and make sure. It means odds are we're filled up. This thing fills up real quick. Uh, if you can't sign up for this week's, make sure you sign up for the next one in two weeks. It's the only way I can almost very sure guarantee you're going to get spots. That's right. This is one of our most popular events we do with the kids, and parents love it. Kids love it. DMs tolerate it. It's a great time. Five bucks uh, when you come to store for this event. And there's a really cool promo we got going on. So if you don't want to spend five dollars for this event and you want to do something to, you know, help the community at large, we're doing our Toys for Tots drive. So you drop right. off a new toy or game still sealed in its package here at the front at the register. We'll sign you up. You get a free seat for DD eventually as long as you signed up online. Once again, no reserved seats that we keep aside for stuff. Yeah. Like, well, I donated. Well, did you sign up online? Well, no. Yeah. Well, they well, still appreciate the gift. Thank you for the donation. Uh, for sure. Please don't take this back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Real, uh, don't be that guy. Yeah. But yeah, D&D Adventures League, sign up now as you're watching this. Pause us. Sign up. Mm -hmm. Don't make your kid upset. That's right, man. And this is going on uh, the, the Toys for Tots drive. You, if you don't like D&D or you don't care for it, you're like, I'm good. You yeah. can still drop off toys. Exactly. Up until December 12th. In fact, we've got a really cool giveaway we're giving away right now yeah. for comics. Um, for, Hero uh, Trade. Hero Trade. You heard that right. So if you uh, drop off a toy, donate a toy or a gift for Toys for Tots, mm -hmm. you can get one ticket in there. Then you're doing a maximum of five tickets for this, three tickets yeah, for this. Three. So you get up to three entries for this thing. This mm -hmm. thing is hot right now. Yeah. Uh, bad idea has no, the calendar doesn't have it on the release date yet. And this is the issue number one of Hero Trade. It's mm -hmm. a big thing. It's huge. 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 Right on. You got until December 12th. And the raffle will... Uh, December 11th. We'll raffle it off, man. There you go. We've only got the one copy left. Only one left. It's a crazy. It's a big deal. That's right. And we also have another giveaway that's, uh, yeah, you're feeling generous as well, man. Yeah, We've got a generous. whole table full of games. That's right. So you buy a game for yourself. Hey, I like Castle Panic. This is a great you know, game. Somebody else might like Castle Panic. We'll give that to you 50% off. 
throw it in the box. As simple as that. It's a great put way. Put it in the box. What's it? Put, put the game in the box. Yeah. What's in the box? It's a Castle Panic game. Ooh, there you go. That's right. So yeah, so it's, we have a whole table that's up the front of the store, behind this bookshelf, near the windows. You'll see it when you walk in. Mm -hmm. uh, buy one, get one half off, and it goes in the donation bin. It's a great way to help people in need, because this year, a lot of people who need it, and Toys for Tots cats are uh, very much needing extra stuff this year. That's right, man. So those are your events this week, man. Take it away, you nerds. Here are your comics for this week. Exciting. X women? Extraordinary! Hmm. <laughs> bring, bring! <laughs> Hello? Mail call! Hey! It's, it's Mailman, Mailman Ivan. Ivan! How's it going, guys? Bell's here. What's yeah. up, man? Well, thank you, sir. Well, no problem. Y'all have a good day. Have you a wonderful too, day in the neighborhood, sir. <laughs> we got another letter. This one's from Jimmy. <laughs> Good old hey, Jimmy. Jimmy. Jimmy, James, Jimson. What will your deals be on Black Friday? Well, wouldn't you know it. Wow, this is oddly specific. It is. It's almost as if it's coincidental that we got this exact mail today, the week before. Well, you know, everybody wants to know. They're everybody like, hey, know. you know what? We've been told we'll find it online. Yeah. Now well, you'll now find it right here on the show. It's online. That's right. So, really special Black Friday deals. We're doing 25%. On everything in the store, that's right, no, no, off. 25% off everything in the store, all day, that's right, everything, all day, 25% off. That's right, man, from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m., we got 50% off of toys, action figures, boxed board games. Wow, mm -hmm. sorry, that does not include Pokemon, X-Wing, or Warhammer stuff for that. Yeah, just like the regular box games. Yeah, so you want to buy Catan, you want to buy Carcassonne, mm -hmm. you want to buy, I don't know, another box board game. Guess what, 50% off like from Castle, Castle Planet. Castle, Castle Planet. Planet. Panic, Castle Panic. There we go. That's also a game you can get 50%. Hey, Castle off. Planet is something I've been working on for a while, and I just oh, kind of really? spilled the jimmies on that one. The jimmies? <laughs> yeah. Today on my secret stash, I only got one book, and it's Venom number 28, the Kale New Wrestling Variant. Look at this delicious cover. This is a low print run, and it is sold out all over the place. We've only got two copies because my boy Joey already picked one up. So don't be jealous. So I want you to get your hands all over my secret stash this Wednesday. Listen here, kiddies. It's time for Tap News Now. I'm Chaz. And I'm Jarek. And, and you're, you're not. not. Here's your geek news for this week. So Magic Gathering's newest set, Commander Legends, released this past weekend. These 20-card packs are perfect for the Commander play in your life and feature several legendary creatures that take the helm of your 100-card deck. Alongside individual boosters, the new pre-constructed decks could have been released as well. Commander Legends is hot right now, as the now officially supported format has taken the community by storm in the past several years. You do not want to be missing out on this release, because these are going to be going real quick. Right on. Yeah. What do we have? Do we have anything to do with this? We, ha we do, yeah. We're selling it. Nice. Yeah. While well, supplies last. So, you know, people call. People call. We'll be like, hey, no, I know. Commander Legends, do you have it? Maybe. <laughs> 
Dr. Fate is not the most popular DC Comics character. No. But he is one of the coolest, and he's getting his own action figure, thanks to Mezco Toys. Nice. From light-up pieces to a, a variety of magical spell projections, he's got 30 points of articulation, wow. multiple interchangeable pieces, and many more. Hmm. So any DC fan would be happy to put Dr. Fate to the collection, right? Any DC fan? Oh, yeah, Dr. Of Fate. Of course. Yeah, Dr. Fate. There you go. Yeah, he's priced at a big old $95. Ooh. He's set to release between March and May of 2021. Wow. Pre-orders are already live and can be found at Mezco Toys. That's Mezco Toys with Zs. There you go. There's a Mez Z. There's a Toys, toys Z. Z. Dot com. Nice. So Games Workshop has kicked off the Broken Realms this past week. It's a widespread shaking of the status quo in Age of Sigmar, their fantasy Warhammer game. Uh, as the balance of power between the god continues to ebb and flow, allegiances crumble and old threats reemerge. The event promises the changes to all current factions, including updated model lines, as well as narrative content. Be sure to check out Broken Realms Marathi, which is the first release for this whole new line. And check it out now to get caught up on all the cool, weird actions going on. A lot of things, people are speculating a lot of things about this, and it's supposed yep. to... Uh, Really, hopefully, shake up that whole market. Very nice. Yeah. Kinda shake cool. it up, baby. Shake it off. WB Games and NetherRealm Studios dropped two new trailers for Mortal Kombat 11 Ultimate. Ooh. Yeah. It looks like Mortal Kombat 2 pack will give us Melina. Okay. And Rain. Okay. Have they just been banished from the Mortal Kombat world? Yeah. And we'll tell you what, Melina looks amazing. Yeah. Yeah, she really does. And uh, they're going to give us an action star. Mm. Yeah, so they've entered uh, RoboCop and the Terminator. <laughs> Love it. Right? So combo pack to get an action star. What do you think? Uh, Rambo. That is correct, sir. Rambo. As, are you serious? Yep. So <laughs> MK fans, since Terminator's dropped, they're like, well, where's, Rambo? where's Rambo? They want a Terminator uh, Rambo. Uh, uh, uh. And uh, I don't know. It's not a cage. I need to stop. Yeah, exactly. Well, less words because Rambo doesn't talk again. Yeah, it really doesn't. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh... That's kind of cool. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. That's going to happen. Oh, mm. uh, Rambo. So uh, here's some news you probably missed this past week. Mm -hmm. uh, police in Santa Cruz responded to a suspicious person call and instead found Bigfoot. Uh, the four-foot-tall wooden statue was recently stolen from a small museum in the nearby town of Felton. Authorities were just relieved the call wasn't in regards to a person of color for once. Oh, yeah. Wow. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> I went there. <laughs> All right. Well... <laughs> In health news, <laughs> in health news, results of a recent study suggest that married men are healthier and live longer than men who are unmarried. I can see that. Yeah. And in celebrity news, happy birthday to Larry King, who just turned 400 last week. <laughs> that man is old. <laughs> All right, so a Japanese town has deployed a pair of monstrous, robotic, howling wolves to discourage bears from the area, which have been seen as pests recently. Uh, they look almost exactly like what you'd expect, monstrous... Japanese robotic howling wolves to look like. And here's a picture. They're terrifying, dude. Scary. Yeah. I'm shaking in my converse. As you should. Uh, <laughs> nice. A little late, but here's some Halloween news. Mm -hmm. A mom from Wisconsin told police that she found a packet of meth in her child's Halloween candy. <laughs> okay. Right after, police asked her why she was raking leaves naked at midnight. <laughs> That's your news for this week. There it is. Take it away, boys. <laughs> Do you guys have any D&D &D stuff? I hate busy days. Hey, how's it going? You see that ludicrous display last night? I mean, seriously, what's he thinking? What display? I mean, you know, injections, disinfectants. I mean, come on, are people really that stupid? Dude, what are you? Are we really gonna have a political chat right now? Hmm? Oh, wait a minute. You were just on your phone. Why don't you just? Uh. Hey, wait a minute. Uh. What's going on? Uh. Dude, what was that all about? I have no idea. <sighs> that
That's the end of our show, man. Before we go, what you getting into? Uh, not a whole lot right now, actually. I'm just no? dealing with stuff. What about you? <laughs> right on. Not nothing bad. This has been like a. I've actually gotten this question a couple times now. Like, no. oh, are you doing all right, man? No, no, I'm. Right? I'm fine. I'm just Everybody's working on worried projects. about Jared. I'm just working on projects. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What about you? Yeah, well, I'll possibly show up on Nerd News now. We're flaky. Yeah, possible. Uh, we're still filming the movie. Oh, so that's fun. And then. Uh, Did you kill anyone yet? Oh, yeah. Nice, perfect. Oh, yeah. Once, like right in the jugular. How so about right in the movie? Did you kill anyone yet in the movie? Oh, no, not yet. Okay, cool. I want to make sure. <laughs> Uh, big shout out to Mike J Photos for doing the Rocket Queen photos this last uh, weekend. It was a lot of fun. I've seen some pictures of that. It's awesome. pretty cool. I uh, know. I can't wait for all the finished stuff. And then, uh, of course, you know what we didn't do hmm. when we did Extra Life? Hmm. I think the man in charge, Bill. Oh, the guy up there. Yeah. He sits in the rafters. He does sit in the rafters. Uh, all the cats who got up there, too. Right? You know, he, you know put, put together this uh, Extra Life deal and... Yeah. Let us play and all that jazz. So thank you, Bill. You're Bill? rocking. Not even that. Thanks for the jobs. We're That's true. Get paid for nerding out. It's pretty awesome. We're getting paid to be idiots on camera right now. <laughs> I, I love it. That's right, man. Check it out, man. On this week's episode of Zoinks, we opened up a donation box for the Texas Children's Hospital from that Spider-Man booth. Oh, there you go. Now, we're not giving anything away from this box, obviously, because it's been donated. It's a donation box. But if you like or comment like you have in the past on the show, well... I'll look at the box that we got from them last time, and we'll do a giveaway from that. There we go. No mm -hmm. problem. To get your very own That Spider-Man booth box, go to uh, thatspidermanbooth.myshopify.com. <laughs> and be sure to visit our web store for all your nerdy needs. Shop.theadventurebeginstx.com. Free shipping to the lower 48 states. Uh, orders over 75. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Alaska and Hawaii. <laughs> New episodes drop every Monday on certain social media platforms, as well as Roku for, for me, me and, and for you. you through thewoodlandsonline.com. Be sure to check out, I don't know, maybe these shows have been canceled. Who knows? Uh, the Adventure Begins Reads and Michaela's Comic Corner. Will they come back? I don't know. Will they be renewed? Who, Who knows? knows? Did Roku was like, we don't like these shows. Like, they were like, you know, I, you know, I got a call from, actually Marky Mark called us. You know, the big boss upstairs, the bigger boss upstairs, the robot who lives above the rafters. Sure. Zuckerberg. Sorry, Zucker bot. He's like, hey, these shows, no more. Sorry, oh, guys. That's it. I did not know that. Yep. We're done. Anyway, when they show up, we'll let you know. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> that is it, dude, for this episode of The Adventure Begins. Uh, Bill, unfortunately, next week, put you in for sure. This week, sorry, the calendar didn't work out. It's mm -hmm. what it is. We hope you guys had a good time. Also, a huge shout out to everyone who came to my garage sale this week. I uh, managed to pawn off quite a bit of stuff to people. That's huh, right, suckers. Man. Well, like they say, man, one man's trash is another man's treasure. It's a great saying. It's a horrible way to find out you've been adopted. See you, nerds. <laughs>"Sweeping the leg of these prices." Yeah. You know what? Uh, well, competitors just better watch out because we're gonna put you in a body bag. No mercy. <laughs> <laughs> Like buy shirt. first, buy hard, buy now. God, I wish you'd be wearing my Cobra Kai stuff right now, man. <laughs> no mercy. Kick the competition. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what it was for. What was it for? I was just talking. I was like, what, what, what happened if I did the flying crane kick right now? What would you do? And he's like, I'd probably do this really cool like response. I'm like, Please, what's the chance? Do that. What's the chance of this actually going off for either of us? Probably zero. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Mail call, bling bling. Hey, hey. <laughs> what? So the knock, you just what, say right here, oh, right, okay. right there. Right so there. <laughs> All right, we've been doing right. this in a while. So, uh, no. so the <laughs> knock happens. All right, a really good time. You'll join us next week for more comics, more games, more news, more events, and a whole lot more here on the Adventure Begin Show. Sorry, man. Something about one man's trash and another man's treasure, am I right? <laughs> well, yeah, but you have What's, to lead me in. Remember? What, what is it? What, what is the lead? I can't remember it. <laughs> you you uh, doing the garage sale. Oh, the garage sale stuff. That's right. Uh, okay. Well done. So, uh, heard you had a garage sale going on this week, huh? No, you had the garage sale. I had a garage sale? Yes. I thought you had the, that's, uh, your whole thing is one man's trash and another man's treasure. No, no I, it is. But yeah. you have to lead me into the joke oh. as far as... <laughs> There's no E in the beginning of Wisconsin. Is it Wisconsin? It's Wisconsin. Okay. It's Wisconsin. How's it, how's it spelled? 
It doesn't matter. No, no, it does. House, House in and Houston. <laughs> same yeah. thing. Humble and Umble, apparently, as well. Yeah, you can see, yeah, Umble. Wisconsin. That's, they don't use uh, the H in Umbuger in France. So what's the state just below Wisconsin? He's <laughs> so mad. What's the state just below Wisconsin? I Like I said, let me do my news, please. <laughs> <laughs> Wisconsin. Do you, do you go to Illinois, too, Ooh. when you're in Chicago? Yeah, Illinois. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. I, I work with you're ends. making too much noise. <laughs> <laughs> what you're doing. Wisconsin. Is it Wisconsin? West is what you're saying. Wisconsin. I'm asking correct. you. Yes, Wisconsin. 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 Wis. Wisconsin. Wis. Yes, There's no Wis. H in there, like a whisk. No, no. There's no Wis. H. Wis. 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 Wisconsin. Yeah. Wis. How do you spell whisk? W H I S K. Yeah. Then why are we saying Wisconsin? Why are you saying Wisconsin? Because you're Wisconsin. making a lot of noise right now, bud. Exactly. <laughs> a mom in Wisconsin. <laughs> All right. I'm done. <laughs> a little late, but here's some Halloween. <laughs> it's even later now. It is later now. All right. She did the math. I know. <laughs> did they get the joke? They got the joke. Come on. Dude. Yeah. All right.